Washington is home to 900,000 immigrants. Nearly one in five Washingtonians are either Latino or Asian. And nearly two thirds of all Asian and more than one third of Latino immigrants. The role the immigrant family play in our economy is increasing. Immigrant entrepreneurs have added tens of thousands of jobs to our economy, including domestic workers. We know we have a lot of domestic workers who work in um, caregiving, um, child care, um, house cleaners, um, who make a difference and all types of work in the United States and Washington State. Um, to our economy and immigrant workers are a crucial component of our state workers or forces. Immigrants contribute $1.5 billion in tax revenue to the Washington state economy in 2007 alone. They, those contributions, immigrant families often face unequal treatment and discrimination. In 2011, the legisl legislator overall vote to restrict access to the state and basic health program to residents who are Medicaid eligible. This effectively excludes many immigrants including lawfully present immigrants who are ineligible for Medicaid because of the five-year bar. Because of this vote, over 17,000 people, primarily immigrants and people of color, lose, lose their job, health care, and the state was sued for discrimination. This was a major step back for immigrant family and for this for those states. The legislator also missed the opportunity to prohibit the mandatory use of Eber5. It's an internet based system used to check employees work authorization. The system is notorious for heroes and result in discrimination against lawfully present workers, including naturalized US citizens and legal immigrants. If verify become mandatory in Washington, more than 17,000 legal workers in US citizens will lose their job because we know this system affected not just only immigrants, also citizens. Up to 79,000 additional legal workers in the US, US citizens will have to go to Social Security Administration office to correct that information in their database or risk losing their job. The legislator must prohibit the mandatory use of this bad system. The action will be benefit immigrant and no immigrant alike. The legislator did some good things to support immigrant community over the past few years. Blocking right when attack and access to drive a license and adjust them rules to so that some lawfully present immigrant arrested for minor offenses can avoid automatic deportation. However, much remains to be done, like prohib prohibiting mandatory either five, expanding healthcare access to include immigrant residents and supporting the dream of immigrant students who are pushing access
to higher education. We are calling on the legislator to do this thing in 2013. We are also calling on the legislator to consider the impact of all legislation of immigrant communities. Thank you very much.